The messenger. Hey there, everyone. <laughs> Why did I do that? Yes, yes. If you hit a fairy, their aura is going to expand. I legitimately forgot that. Like, I just... Like, no, no excuses or anything. I legitimately completely forgot that was a gameplay element. So this is a funky little shape, right? It goes like that. Then you can go to mountain, but then there's a second path, which I also have to visit. So, I think the best thing to do- oh, I love the music here. Mushroomy crag, here we go. Honestly, but- but, like, the glacier has a portal, right? So I think I'm just gonna do, like, the back and forth. And then next time I can start a glacier from its portal. Might be a little bit awkward to explore, but I'll take a little bit of awkwardness. That's fine. Awkwardness can be fun. Wow, that was... I did it. I found this thing. It's just here in the side passage that exists. And here we go through time in a place I couldn't go. You need to be in the past to be a... Oh. Wait, how do I cross there? Yeah, and here there's a barrier. Um, I have a shuriken. Alright, well, let's try. I'm probably gonna die. Yeah, okay. Kinda saw that coming. Um, uh-huh. Right, and the uh, portal doesn't count as, uh, as a save. That's fine. That fell- okay, so either- Look, I had to try it. So either there's a passage in the back that I didn't notice, I'm gonna look back on the map, but there's also the possibility that there's a thing that I'm gonna find that's gonna like freeze up that- oh, ew, I don't know, look at that. There is a back passage. So there's a possibility of something that goes to the uh, left somewhere of that thing. Or you can go in the other on, in, in, in the other timeline. Like you can't just cheat like that, unfortunately. Like as tempting as it is, I don't think it's something I can make happen. Yeah, now yeah, see they're very careful about deciding what kind of uh, time I can be in there. Very purposeful. And there's no side passage. So either- okay, let's look at the global map. I'm here. Could be uh, something you reach from the, uh, from the underworld, though. That's not impossible. Hmm. Man, honestly, I feel like I barely touched this place. I think maybe- okay, you know what, I don't know. I have ideas, but none of them are good. So let's keep going up, I guess, for now. Like, I'm just wondering, it could be a passage from the underworld. That would make sense, maybe. Like, that these would be connected. I mean, it's just, it's a different, like, it's a similar vibe, you know, the lava and underground and all that. You know, that's what underworld be. Destroy the world, then bop into the turtle, cause he has more health than most. I saw that thing right here. I saw it at the last minute, I need to go up. <sighs> really? And I messed up utterly and completely. I didn't jump, uh, I didn't hit the rock. Everything just went smashingly. <laughs> I don't know, no, now it's just spikes if you change. Yeah, there's, but anyways, yeah, like, it's covered, the future path is covered, so I can't go to the Pokemon just normally. But no, yeah, there's no back wall, so, yeah, it's either you get there in another time and the lava's, like, all not lava, or something. Or you can just go from the back. But it's the fact that... I feel like roping here would be a mistake. Oh, I didn't- it doesn't even, like, get me out. Oh my god. This one is kind of hard, like, I'm not- I'm not sure yet. Hi, Quib- wait, what? You're Quibble? Hi, well, hey! Pleased to meet you. 
if I do this, is this gonna put a save? Oh, it does. Okay. Then it got rid of, uh, Smiley. There we go! Keep it simple! We, we're gonna call that simple, I guess. But yeah, just time your job with the fallen rocks. It's fine. It's just, you gotta get that initial timing. Like, that's that's the one thing, you know? Yeah, let's check out upstairs. And, ooh. So, like, I can't help but notice, we are getting really close to, um... Where the power thistle was growing. So we will be in a grown state. And it's where I thought that I might be interested in a oh shoot. Uh in um Alright, there we go. Not exactly what I meant to do, but yeah, power thistle and stuff. And rocks! Here we got the portal. Oh, that's in regular port. Oh! Oh, and hey, that's how you get to the glacier. I, I was wondering about that. I got a power thistle! Oh, that's a good point. Hey, guys. Your bones are holding up pretty good. Alright, um... Okay, I mean, they're at the bottom of the... Yeah. At the bottom of that thing, there's a time thing. I'm just wondering if there's a closer time thing here at the start of Glacier. <laughs> That would be good. Uh, I don't know. Well, I'm here. This is wh where I'm gonna go to time change. Alright, don't look at what's happening here, okay? This is not happening. We're here only for the time change. Which is even further up. Yeah, okay, I that was probably a mistake. But you know what? It's fine. It's okay, don't think about it. Yeah, there's like stuff going on everywhere. Wow, pretty amazing. Don't think about it. So, so somewhere in this room, there's a timeline. Yeah, this is. Oh, it's here. It's kind of no. Whoa, shoot! How did I let that happen? So if I go here, whoa, dude! How did that happen? I don't know. So if I go here. I switched the timeline, so I can just fall down there, and I'm gonna be able to, uh, enjoy, yeah, the resplendent NES-ness of things right here. It's all good. There we go. Doing things, maybe. Hey, rope is still here. Fantastic. Love me a rope that someone left here. It's very handy. Alright. So, hey buddies. Hmm. Yeah, you got like two spots for flowers. There, these guys are great. Also, uh, I have a flower of your own. Uh, that's right. Uh, what is up is what comes down. Yeah, don't, don't worry about it. <laughs> this is where he gets... Oh, it's chugging time! Oh, jeez. Oh, that is impressive. Oh, you do not have to do that, but it's also pretty impressive. <laughs> Uh-oh, what are you guys gonna do? That's mean! I'm not done here! <laughs> oh man. And, like, I got got in diagonal. Yeah, where am I being sent exactly? Uh... This completely new and different area of which I know nothing. Yeah, this place is gigantic, but I only have access to a tiny little bit of it. Okay, well, good. Probably. Um... So, hey, Ditto, I'm gonna answer your question. I'm in the past right now, 
What happens if we go into... Oh. We just automatically go back and... But here we go back. Okay. So, we stay in, um... 16 bits whenever we end up in the tower, but we'll return to this time when we actually go out of place. A little funky, but I get it. And also that prevents it from being used as a way to like cheat maybe distances somewhere. Why distances? I don't know. Locations. Banana phones. Yeah, don't want to cheat that banana phone! Rocking out. That's all no, what's going on exactly? But I'm doing yet though, yes sir. I'm gonna go over here. Blown to the wind to yesterdays. It's like yesterday. Uh I don't know what I just accomplished. Well maybe now I can go back up and Yeah, be confronted by mighty leaves. Stuck over the heavy object and don't forget your greaves. Oh, that's how you get out. Oh, yeah, you can't go up here any other way because you'll, uh, that rock, like, you don't have an ability to attack up. So I just kind of accidentally did the right thing here. Yeah, I did that. Uh, all right. This is pretty scary. The sky is really ready. Whoa. Be friendly to me, please. Do a mighty leap, sheep. Go in somewhere sleepy. Uh, I don't know what is the perv- Oh! 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 Okay. <laughs> Not a minor little gift. This is this whole segment entirely devoted to a musical note. It's so funky to me that the musical notes are just kind of there. They're in places. They're like really roundabout places, but key of strength. It is one of the notes needed to create a melee that will break the curse. Force into being by the two ogre strength. Cool. Skeleton right here. Here we go. So otherwise I would have been here, I would have seen the up door, and I would have been frustrated at not being able to up door. Interesting. That is really cool. Uh, yeah, I need to pick back up my plant though. But okay, no, you know what? I'll go down, I'll get this coin. And then I can go back up, get my plant, and I'll be done with the crags. This whole room does nothing, though. That's so weird. I don't get it. Why is that there? Whoa. That was scary. Oh, yeah, this is when we gain the rope, right? You can kind of tell. I was getting kind of afraid that it'd be like a line that I couldn't really go through. I mean, I might as well like check the whole thing and... Whoa, in 16 bit because that's sort of what I'm trying to do. Yeah, see, this is where we learn all about the ropes. Whoa, I almost didn't make it. So, alright, so initial room. So, like, yeah, we're just gonna be playing through this. Just like playing the game normally. It's fine. This is what we're here for. This is kind of funny because I just kind of did a whole lot of it backwards, but... Hey, why did my claw just refuse to get anywhere useful there? I'm not sure. Yeah, I just did like a whole lot of it backwards, but it was on the NES, so we'll see how things differ, maybe. We might not notice how things differ. Kind of hard to predict sometimes. Here we go. Yeah, then I remember how I just did not use really my ropes anywhere. So you'll be seeing a lot of pop. Whoa, this is already like kind of a bit more major here. Here we go. All right, you know what? I got hit by that thing in a way that I was just impatient. That's fine. I realize it. All right, so I mean, this has you know you don't really use your rope for that. You just you just kind of do it. All right, that guy's rocking. Good for him. Here we go. Some juice, a little bit of green in my system. Oh wait, yeah, now that's open and that's where I'm going. And the fact that there's a save zone like right there, pretty good. Oh shoot, uh, uh, here we go. Yeah, doing it! Okay, so I kind of see what's going on here. Gonna go down through the carousel. 
then we're gonna dodge around the spending durian. Here we go right up. How is that for lunch? Not particularly edible. Okay, I messed up. <laughs> I, 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 I messed up. Oh, sure, I don't know if that was different text or not. I tend to just kind of text. I got button through it. You know, I'm dead. I'm like, all right, I'm excited. I want to keep going. Sometime not compatible. What, what's going on? All right, you know what? Perfect. Perfect smash through. Just tank the hits and go through. It's fine. Your invincibility period is like fantastic. And, uh, yeah, and your air recovery is magical. So I feel like I didn't do that right, but I did it. So, you know what? It's fine. It's totally okay. Oh, all these things are back. I don't know why, but hey, cool. More stuff for me. All dogs are running. Hey, look, my slash is very wide, but it doesn't go behind me. Don't be ridiculous. Be ridiculous a little bit if you want. You can't stop. Oh, it's because I died at all the lamps are filling again. And yeah, just like there's no more side paths or anything. We are just going where we're going. Fantastic. I'm still mystified by that massive giant. I guess it's it has to be giant to accommodate the um, like the whole like you know how you're like scrolling through the lands after you're being kicked. Like is that why there's just that big massive room of which you are allowed to exist in a tiny little part? I mean I'm satisfied with that explanation. I just. I'm, I'm making an assumption here that that is the explanation, but I don't actually know for sure. Uh, I, don't, I don't have to kill everyone. Just most of them. It's fun. Alright, here we go. We are going over here. I could go straight up, too. Is there a reason to choose one over the other? Oh, yeah! That money pit! I've never been there. Yeah, that'll be open up for me. That was closed off for me before. I am getting close to getting my um, 2K here. Which is supposed to unlock like a new attack, right? That's exciting to think about. Watch out, oh man, falling things. I know, right? Yeah, this is where things meet up. I cannot go up there. There is one way to go in that room. And it's by making two ogres really, really happy. Yeah, that's the place that I can go down and get a crystal. Give me all the money. 65, I think, is the worth of these. Well, yeah, I'm 65 closer. Where I'm going to be sometime in the past of... Uh-oh, okay, well... Oh, yeah, I can do that. Here we go. Somewhere indeed, destroy the world a little bit at the time for me. If you would. Like, you don't have to, but I would appreciate it. Uh, but it's not a kind of labor Wait, Is that a word here? I don't know. It's kind of task you can just put on someone else. Do, do, do. No, no, no. Alright, you know what? Oh, well, I can't go there anyway. Wow, that's a NES only little side room coin. You can tell because the room is green. But, you know, there's not, like, the drawing of a coin there. Well, that's kind of a tricky little spot. There you go. There we go. See, in the future, when you've been very much used to the concept of the rope dart, is when they really ask you to use it a lot more seriously. I appreciate that. Oh my gosh, it's a shrimp! Just flying off like a shrimp. That looks kind of like, yeah, that is like in reference, maybe, to the big room over there. I don't know. Dum -da -dum -dum. Big empty room with shrimp that's coming from the ground, as well as a dog running around. Running around like a dog! Dogs like running, probably. Well, I'm sure there's some that are lazy. Just gonna uh, let themselves get hopped over by a fox. We'll check it out. We're here. So, yeah, so we have uh, reunited with what we were doing at the start of the day and uh, we will now do something else well we're gonna get up we're gonna get our pea leaves we're gonna see what that's gonna do and that's gonna be the end so things that I have left going 
I have the dark room. We I have the sunken zone place. Now I have a Fokin on the other side of a bit of lava. The bit of lava is too large for me to just be able to hop over. My theory is to get there in the future, but it is time locked. And, uh, no, yeah, that's a pretty accurate and complete summary. But there's a passage behind, so I'm thinking I'm gonna get back there. Look at that! Astral tea leaves! Oh, I need to return there manually? That's annoying. Ah, uh, the path from here is really quick. Alright, let's just do that real quick. While I'm here, before I go in time and do that, uh, I was asked to check if you can go off the pier at the extreme left. Because when you're in on the NES, you cannot. There is an invisible wall that does not let you go further than like the edge of the pier that aligns with the green square. But it's true that the map goes like even further than that. It'd be strange if you were allowed to go further with, uh, you, but no, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, no, no, yeah, no, yeah. I think the map is larger to accommodate for the cutscene of flying through hell and into this area on top of the dragon. So similar to the huge empty room that does nothing in, um, in the crags, now that I think about it. That is so strange, but, like, I get it, like, it's like this weird little limit on their engine. Hey boss, I'm here! I got some leaves! Uh, yeah, he leaves for you! Hey Sassel T, once again. I did it! <laughs> yes! You did mention that. Alright, here's a candle. A candle! Oh, that's funny. That is really funny. <laughs> That's really funny. Uh, I kind of want to do Dark Cave, so maybe next time... Yeah, okay, you know what, yeah. Since I'm kind of in the area-ish, let's find a place to save. This saved. Yeah, next time, uh, like, all I need to do is I go there, I can return to the guild, whoop, whoop, the wrong, wrong buttons. Then I'll be able to teleport. Eh. There's no real, like, quick way to get there. But I got a means to do it. I kind of want to do it. Ah, uh, no, Raukau, the method, though. No, 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 yeah, no, the method, the method, we're keeping it real, we're keeping it real, let me, I'm, let's keep it, keep it in a real place. Hey, just passing through, I'm almost at 2000. Wait, so I just came in through the world in, well, I don't think it's gonna matter, but I'm just curious. Yeah, so, okay. So it... it filtered me over. Alright, so I'm gonna save here, and next time I'm gonna cross over, I'm gonna go up that rope, and next time, Glacial Peak, where we'll meet a friend at the end, uh, finally. I thought it'd be something in every boss arena, turns out they're the exceptions more- th Wait a sec, I got 2,000 passively. Alright, uh, just- I, I'm never gonna end this video, it looks like. Yeah! Uh, this. Demon's Bane, by mastering patient focus, can wait as they charge your next attack, making deal triple damage. And then it's at 400. So it's just wait? Wait, what does that mean? Um, let's find out. Passively charge. I'm not doing anything. Whoosh! Okay, okay, alright. And you get that flash that tell you you're ready. All right, so it's not even like a charge, like it's a, it's an auto charge. Not used to seeing my money so low. <laughs> <laughs>